So the story I did last week for the New York Post was about Diane Feinstein, who unfortunately had recently passed away. She was a seriously liberal person in the Senate. What maybe was less known, particularly in light of her political leanings, is that she was also extremely wealthy. She married a gentleman by the name of Richard Blum, who made a ton of money, you know, on Wall Street and in investing. They jetted around on a private Gulf Stream. She had a giant, beautiful home in Washington, D.C. They had a vacation house in Northern California, and she had one biological daughter and three daughters through her husband, Richard. Richard Blum. And the biological daughter was in litigation for her to be able to sell some of the possessions she had. But alas, she did not sell it, you know, and she unfortunately passed away, but she left behind quite a large estate. Everybody, of course, is sad to see her go, but her stepchildren and, you know, her daughter, they will all certainly benefit. So <laughs> cheers to them.